<laughs> so the way that they do it is they have various charts. So they have like the chart. And then they have like the country chart and the rock chart, and those ones are hard to get on. And then there's something called the comedy chart, which is there's just nobody competing for a spot. So if you put your song in that category, you can have someone say that about you without too much trouble. So I started writing songs because I had a video blog and I didn't know how to keep people entertained. It was getting to be a bit much to just talk all the time, so I, I started writing songs, and I'm not entirely sure, I have a set list here, but I don't, I, I'm not, I don't feel very faithful to it. I mean, she's, she's nice and everything. I don't feel like we mesh yet, but we'll see if we get there. Um, so I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm immediately going to cheat on her, actually, I've decided. Um, this song is the first song that I ever wrote put on the internet, and I, I don't know if I should sing it, because do, do British people even know who Helen Hunt is? Do not. Right? Kind of. Raise your hand if you know who Helen Hunt is. See, that's a lot fewer people who know than who know who Leroy Williamson is, for example. <laughs> Which I think Helen would be kind of sad about, but she'll handle it. Well, Helen Hunt is an actress, and when I was a young man, I loved her. So I wrote this song for her. Oh, shoot. <laughs> why, why would I ever deviate from the set list? Um, oh, come on. Where is it? Thanks, Catherine. <laughs> the first time I saw her was the day that I hit puberty. She played a beautiful girl shunned by society. It wasn't her fault. She just smoked one laced doobie. That after school special made me want to never do PCP. Oh, Helen Hunt, Helen Hunt, you make my heart do acrobatic stunts. You stand and face the brunt of the twister of my burning blunt. Helen Hunt, you know I'm mad about you. So Helen Hunt was in a movie called Twister and a TV show called Mad About You, and there's also lots of other Helen Hunt references that you just won't get, but that's okay. <laughs> So I'll write songs about other stuff that I like. And I really like Harry Potter and the last Harry Potter movie. Back in 2007, so I, was, I wrote this song about the last Harry Potter book coming out. And then I wrote to YouTube and I was like, hey YouTube. This was the old days of YouTube when they were like people. Uh, uh, the last Harry Potter book's coming out. You should do a front page special on the fact that the last Harry Potter book is coming out. And if you want to do that, I have a really great suggestion for a song that you might want to feature. And it was this song. Kind of time it is. Free publication near it's you got all the muggle kind of your spell. Don't you know the whole bunch of you got and reserved a copy at Amazon? How many more books could you sell? Give me my book or go to hell, cause I need 